I'm finally going to start putting together the grill that came with our camper. Um, these two boxes I pretty much set aside uh, when we first got our camper. Um, other than I did open up this one to just throw the uh, cord for the propane in it. Um, otherwise I haven't really touched these yet. Um, this hangs on the outside of the camper and then you can grill on it. Let's see what's in the box. So these are basically the feet so that you can set it on a table, um, but it has these brackets that look like they go into the arms for the part that hangs on the side of the camper. So just looking at this, these arms slide out, and this is where the railing is that hooks on the side of the camper. Um, and these arms come out and basically, I assume these pull out. So then you can take this and slide it on to those. It says this sits on top, so I guess this doesn't really connect to it in any way other than it is super heavy. So I doubt it would fall off. So that's basically it, it looks like. So we'll put the railing on the trailer. This slides into the railing, and then this will hook up to the propane tank um, on the camper right here, and in the Quick Connect. Alright, so putting the grill together was super easy. Now I'm going to attempt to attach it uh, to the camper, um, and then season the griddle. So this just hooks on here, I believe. These arms come out. You need to remove the pins on the end. Then you just need to line up the holder and it'll go in. Still, it's in there, and then to secure it, you just re put these pins in. And then to hook it up to the gas, there's this cable. This just hooks into the back. Like a quick connect, and this goes underneath the camper. And then each of these have an on off switch. Everything's off right now, so I need to turn the gas on, and then I'll turn these two switches on. Alright, so I turned the gas on in the front, and then I had to turn the switch on that end of the cord and the back here. And then it says just turn it to the light position for five seconds and it should light. So I can hear it and it's warm. Um, the next thing we'll do is put the top on and season it. Um, the other thing you can do is you can take the tray out to see the flame when you have the top on if you can't tell if it's on or not. Alright, so I put the griddle on top. Um, it just sits on top, but it is pretty heavy, so it's pretty secure. Um, the only thing I've done with this so far is wash it with soap and water. Um, so now we're going to put uh, extra virgin olive oil on it, and then uh, turn the burners on and let it uh, burn off, basically. And you're going to do that a few times uh, to season it.
That looks like a pretty good layer. So now we're going to turn it on. Um, it said medium high heat. And then eventually that'll start smoking. We can turn it off, let it cool down and do it a couple more times and then it should be fully seasoned and ready to use.